Oh, good morning, everybody. So, yesterday we had that business about uh, trying to squeeze an extra hour out of the day, a little time management stuff. Actually, that could, those things probably help you squeeze a lot more than an hour out of the day if you're if you're having enough trouble already and only getting an hour's worth of stuff done. <laughs> All right, listen, um, along those same lines, there's memory. And I don't really have a whole lot of memory. I, I call myself a man with a terrible memory, but, um, and I'm gonna address that in a minute. But I'll tell you a little, little story about a guy. I, I had a tape, this is when they had cassette tapes, right? and um, played in my car, and this was like a 10 or 15 minute talk by this fella, and it went something like this. He says, all right, uh, and he gave some techniques in it, which I'm not going to do. I'm, everything's conceptual for me, right, pretty much. All right, but this guy says, um, he says, all right, you know how you, you uh, hear about or see on television or occasionally meet these fellas that you know, they can walk into a room and there's a hundred people in there and, you know, 15 minutes later, they can tell you every single one of their names or, or the, you know, these fellows that, you know, you give them a book and they can tell you what's on page 56 in the third paragraph. And he says, you know, there's not many guys like that. He says, um, he says, however, I'm one of those guys. He says, I'm, I'm the guy that can do all that. He says, and here's here's newsflash for you. He says, actually, I'm not so special. He says, if you want to be that guy, you can be that guy too. He says, here's how I became that guy. He said, there's a ton of work and practice. And he says, realistically, I know for a fact, there's not one of you in a thousand listening to this that are going to go to the effort to do all those things says, you're not going to become that guy, probably. He says, but, says he, there's a lot of space in between. He says, and I can help you get, you know, thousand percent more than you've already got just in the next few minutes. He says, and, he, um, and he outlined a few things. And I've told this before. There were three things he outlined. And the, the fun part of this is, I forgot what one of them is. <laughs> But I remember two of the others. Um, and I have a note with one of them written on it. He, he said, uh, actually, I guess I got all three of them. He said, for one thing, you know, earlier on, I just remember I said um, about my memory and all. He says, for one thing, just stop saying I have a bad memory. Just don't do it. You know, if you just become the guy that doesn't say that, that he says that is worth something. If you say, I have a bad memory, then the rest of your being has to live up to the words that come out of your mouth. You know, we're not talking about you know, changing yourself by positive talk, which I, I do know is a useful technique. It actually works if you want to do those things. But, you know, your body doesn't have to respond to negative talk either, right? So don't say it. He says, just don't do that anymore. And look at my notes, right? He said, and this is big, and this helped me tremendously. I got to tell you, I went from the guy that didn't remember anything to the guy that pretty well um, could learn the names of a crowd of people. Not fast like those fellows do when they know the hundred, but, you know, over a few weeks, uh, when I was introduced to, um, you know, I'm in Rotary, okay? A long time ago, a guy took me to a Rotary meeting. There were about 50 people there. And, you know, he kind of dropped me on my head and said, yeah, see you later. And he went off to talk to the guys he knew. <laughs> so, but I, I did come back the next week. But I'd practice. And, that, and I'd recite, you know, like, uh, that guy's name was Jim and that guy's name was Bob. And, you know, and... I recited these things in my head, so I worked at it. And don't you know, I got results from that. I became the guy that knew everybody in the room in about a month. 
and that was when we only met weekly, right? Um, so his second piece of advice that fell on the tape was try harder. Just, I mean, that's, that's a call out to us. It's just like, you know what? You're not having success because you're not even trying to have success. You're just saying, I can't do it. And um, I have to admit that that describes where I was with that. So, and I, you know, we, we get what we work for, don't we? All right. The um, other thing he, he gave on that, see, apparently I remembered all three now, is uh, that you can do association, and you probably heard of that before. And apparently the more outrageous the association, the, uh, the more effective it is. So, you know, you could, if it's something about, you know, you know, I don't, I, I really don't want to do it. The, the guys on tapes do this, but you build these associations and after a while you have um, um, your aunt um, wearing a diving suit, walking on a high wire, you know, balancing eggs. And, you know, you just create these incredibly stupid scenarios, but it helps you remember a list when each one of those, you know, like the eggs that had to do with um, picking up eggs at the store, right? And, uh, you know, your aunt, it was a birthday and uh, you, or, or something like that. So for each one of these things on a list, you can, um, you know, add it into this thing. Now, I will say this. I have not had success with that when I make my story too long. You know, about half a dozen things is as much story as I can much list as I can cram into a story, but by golly, it works. It works. So those are your three things. And I'm going to harken back to one thing. The video just before this, I did on uh, time management about your list. Those of us who, um, who work against our own memories, you know, you really, really rely on those lists. So I send you back to, to the list inf information. Do that and, um, you know, note taking. Those are the things that uh, save my butt, save your butt too, if you're anything like I am. Alrighty, there you go. Thousand percent memory improvement just because you're going to try harder. <laughs> All right, you got it. Go remember something. Hey, friends, I hope this was useful to you. Would you do something for me? Would you please share this with anybody you know that ought to hear it too? And then, would you please uh, give me the thumbs up and subscribe, right? That's kind of important on these things. Uh, feel free to leave comments. All right, thanks a lot. And now get out there and do some winning.